Hello everybody, today we make a penne alla vodka with the shrimp. The ingredient we got, penne, shrimp, half and a half, parsley from my garden, garlic, grana padana cheese, you can use any kind of the cheese you want, pecorino, parmigiano. We got vodka and I got my homemade tamer sauce. Okay, first thing we start with the garlic. I want to chop really thin. As special is it's easy to chop. Because you do like this, maybe you can chop your finger. And as special, I like to make the garlic flat. Not too thin and not too big. Okay, that's it. Now we got the parsley. In the parsley, we chop the same way, a little thin. And now the parcel over here, I like to put it on this little monkey dish. Okay, now the water boil, I like to put, I got sea salt over here, it's for the pasta, the penne. And I put salt, I put a three teaspoons of salt, okay, you got a lot of water. And now we use the penne. Okay. And make sure when you do make a lot of water and add salt and make a nice turn. Okay, now we got prepared for the shrimp. And the shrimp, I gotta use oil, olio di oliva, and we got garlic. I chop the garlic and we put over here, get the shrimp be like so much garlic. All right. This is the shrimp I got over here, but first I want to make a beautiful color, not too dark, the garlic, the inner garlic burn. And now we put the shrimp, and make sure to put each one separate. Now the shrimp, what I did, I clean, but I left the shell on a wing, on a tail, not on the wings, on a tail, okay? I was wash and make sure the dry good when you done everything. Okay, now we put a little salt on the shrimp. And we put a black pepper. Okay, and now we give a nice turn for the shrimp. And look how beautiful the shrimp is looking now. Okay, you don't gotta cook it too much. The shrimp, you cook it too much, it come out too hard. The shrimp, you gotta be nice and crunchy. And now what I gotta do with the shrimp, the shrimp is say, I'm in the water all the time. Why you don't give it to me a little drink? You know why? We give it the vodka. And the shrimp, he likes so much when you give something okay never was in drink it like the vodka now we leave evaporated the vodka we load the gas and we take the shrimp out look how beautiful the color of the shrimp but this it's really really nice look that okay we leave a boil a little bit to castilli got this and i got my omega tomato sauce I don't use all the garlic, I got only 12 ounces of the pen, the pasta. Okay, and we put the sauce. Okay, let me make a nice turn of the sauce. Okay, this is enough for the tomato sauce. Okay, now what I want to do, I want to taste the sauce, so it's good enough for salt. They see the salt, the sauce already, when I cook, I put a salt, but you gotta make sure. It's really good, but you need a little bit more salt. Okay, after we gotta put half and a half cream. Okay, the pasta is almost done, and we put the half and a half cream. And what I wanna do, in case you got a little bit over here, I take a little sauce. And make sure that all the cream is in the dish, the pots. 
All right, and now we give a nice turn on this. All right. Now, the pasta, still it's a little bit al dente, but what I want to do, I want to cook the pasta a couple of more minutes inside with the sauce. We turn the gas off for the pasta, and now we take and we drain the pasta like this, and we put it right inside over here. We load the gas, kind of want to boil too much. I got a lot of requests from the people to make this dish. Well, I want to make it. And this, it's really, really good. It look really good. I want to make everybody happy. I want to make this dish. I hope everybody like. Okay, now we put the shrimp back. Okay, it cook like maybe a couple of more minutes together. The shrimp go back and the vodka again. Eh, eh, the shrimp say thank you very much, Pasquale. I like this. Okay, now we leave it cook a little bit more. At the time of this you gotta cook, I want to use cheese. I gotta put the grana padana. But I want to say salute chin chin to everybody. Chin chin, salute. Uh, all right, now we put cheese. And let's make a nice turn with the cheese. And this is gonna come really, really creamy. Okay, a little bit more, and this may be done. Okay, now this is done. Turn the gas off. Okay, let's bring it right over here on the table. All right, and now I want to taste my thin lavaca with the shrimp. Okay. Now, Pasquale, make sure to put a little more cheese, okay? Okay, good. A little fresh parsley lay on the top and my wine too and I don't want to miss mmm and the shrimp you see you leave the tail you put the shrimp on the mouth and you squeeze and it come out really really good the shrimp cook perfect and the pasta, everything delicious. Salute, e chin chin de vivare, e thank you so much to look at this video. I hope somebody make a you let me know. I know everybody like this dish. Salute, e chin chin de vivare, and we see next time. Chin chin, salute.